Hey, my name's Kevin Landucci. I've helped a ton of software engineers get better jobs and compensation packages than they imagined. Stripe is one of the coolest companies I've come across. Here's why. Stripe is pretty cool, not just for the high compensation packages, not just for the cutting edge interview process, but at Stripe, you're building tools for other engineers. Stripe's core product is SDK and API based. It's a developer tools company. I mean, they don't say that because they're a finance company, but for you, if you're an engineer, it's developer tools. That's one of the coolest spaces in the entire tech market. Getting into the money. This is a starting point for what you can make. Uh, their leveling is a little bit weird though. So they call L4 staff and L5 would probably be senior staff, L3 senior. And these are the corresponding total comps uh, for those levels. Not bad. The type of engineers that do really well at Stripe are engineers with a non-traditional background and or engineers who really like practical interview processes. Every, every interview process is on a spectrum from theoretical, kind of like Google, to practical, kind of like Stripe. So what's practical about these processes are they're just going to have you get into an unfamiliar code base, download it into your environment, and either debug some code or make a feature. You probably won't find that anywhere else. So how do you prep for that? We'll talk about that at the end. Here's the interview process at a high level. One round, recruiter screen. Second round, tech screen. Then on site with five rounds. Pretty, pretty normal in that they're system design and behavioral. They do both of these a little bit differently. We'll talk about that. Coding, pretty normal, though it is practical and more real world applicable. But here are the unique points. The debugging and integration round. The recruiter screen, uh, pretty basic recruiter screen. We don't really need to go over anything that's special about it. We'll cover it in the behavioral portion. Tech screen. Stripe cares about working code, less so about efficiency. So just aim for working solutions as your most important priority. This is the theme. Stripe problems are not going to look like problems that you've come across. They're going to seem more like a story. If this happens, what would you do? Or if you had to build a feature like this, how would you do it? Or if you were going to make this data structure, how would you put it into this environment? It requires a little bit more parsing to get to the root of the question. But the cool thing is it's not so theoretical that it has nothing to do with regular software engineering. So this debugging and integration round that you'll see at the onsite is the most unique thing in Stripe's interview process. If you can find 10 other tech companies and do this, I'll be absolutely shocked. Uh, basically, you download that unfamiliar repo, you get familiar really quickly, you figure out the issue, and then you find those bugs and design a solution. Pretty cool. For those coding rounds, the integration rounds, another super unique thing here to Stripe. Same thing in terms of unfamiliar repo, getting familiar really quick, but instead of debugging, you're going to build a simple feature. How the heck do you prep for this? We're almost there. Don't worry. System design at Stripe little bit different of a flavor. Like we said earlier, a lot of their core product is API based. So there's added emphasis on the API part of the system design rounds. Now, down leveling is a real thing and it sucks. So just remember, if you're going for that above the senior level roles like staff or senior staff, though you want to talk about the API, you probably want to talk about it in more terms that are high level like talking about we need to establish a contract between these two services instead of getting so deep that you're actually writing the code that you would write for the API. There's an argument you could make that you would write that code and still be high level, but probably not. Nonetheless, you want to sharpen up your API knowledge if you're going to system design around at Stripe. And lastly, there are two types of companies, companies like Amazon and companies like Microsoft. Companies like Amazon have a very specific way they evaluate culture fit. Companies like Microsoft don't. They just kind of look for red flags and see if you're not a fit. Stripe is more like Amazon. How do we know? Because they have weird values, values you've never seen before. How many times have you seen this word in a company's list of company values? Never. Stripe actually prioritizes kindness. This is a little bit odd for a tech company, but it is found in other places. So they actually evaluate you on some specific traits and that makes your behavioral prep slightly different. You just want to make sure you hit some of those notes that you know that they like. And now we are at the end, the way to prep for those really weird coding rounds. Mimic the environment, time yourself, 
download an unfamiliar repo on GitHub, take a ticket for a super simple feature or a super simple bug, and see if you can get those done really quickly in as little time as possible. The cool thing is that actually makes you a better engineer at your day job. Stripe is not one of these companies that's going to have you do dynamic programming or some data structure and algorithms questions that are just completely only useful for college students. Stripe is a company that understands what engineering excellence is all about. They don't care about your resume. They just care about your practical skills. If you've got a non-traditional background or you're an entrepreneur or you like the sound of this type of engineering, Stripe is the place to check out. That's pretty much everything you need to know in a couple minutes about the Stripe software engineering interview process. Check out this guide if you want to get all the details and not just the ones that we went over. We also have a ton of other guides for other companies and other positions. Engineering, product, program, data. Check out tryexponent.com. Get a bunch of our free content. My name is Kevin Landucci, and I will see you soon.